Hello everybody, Blackstar Emperor here, and today we're going to be taking a look at Nintendo's own authentic wireless Sega Genesis controller for the Switch. Just like the Nintendo Entertainment System and the Super Nintendo Entertainment System, the Genesis has its own controller for use with the Genesis app on your switch in terms of functionality it's actually really good it's a very good well-built controller that looks and feels just like an original Genesis controller and here is footage of the Genesis controller in action Okay, now crappy game footage aside, um, that is pretty much how it functions. It functions, well, just like you expect the Genesis controller to work. Now, the ultimate question is, is this controller worth the $65 Canadian that it's worth? Well, it's hard to say. Well, I mean, yes, if you're going to play Genesis games with your Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack, then yes, it's absolutely worth it. However, if you're going to use it in other games, you might be disappointed. Because this controller just doesn't have the buttons to work in any other game besides the Genesis app, really. So, for $65... I mean, obviously, if you're going to play the Genesis app, and let's be real, I'm sure 99.9% .9 of people who buy this are going to play it so they can play the Genesis app. But, um, yeah, if you're going to plan on playing it for other games, well, it's kind of not really worth, worth it. Especially when I could do so much more with this. I mean, with this controller, um, there's actually quite a few games I can play with this controller really well. Like, for example, Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 1 and 2, Rayman Legends Definitive Edition, New Super Mario Bros. U, Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze, and a bunch of other games, too. So, yeah, so, and by the way, this controller is also $25 less, not including the taxes and the shipping, but yes. So it's $25 less on the base price, and you could do more with it. But of course, just like how people are buying this to play the Genesis games, most people buy this to play the Super Nintendo games. Same thing with the Nintendo controller. But again, it's the basic principle is the same. Most people are buying these controllers to play retro games. Let's be realistic. So in that regard, should you buy the Genesis controller for your Switch? Well... Yes, but only if you're going to play Genesis games via the Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack. Now, I know there is um, a Genesis collection on the Switch. I think it was like Sonic 
not Genesis collection, but like something else. I don't know if this controller is compatible with that game or not. But, um, yeah, but with the Genesis app, it will work. So, yes. So, if you're going to play the Genesis app, then yes, definitely pick up this controller. If not, then, well, like I said, it's not very good for other games. But, uh, yeah. But, like I said, most people are buying this so they can play Genesis. Uh, with that said, um, yes, it is a good controller, and, yeah, I'd say pick it up, if you're planning on playing Genesis games, that is. And who knows, maybe, maybe one day we'll get some games that will be compatible with this. But until then, yeah, like I said, again, if you're going to play the Genesis on the expansion pack, then yes, definitely get this controller. If not, then, well, well, there's no real point in owning it. But with that said, um, uh, thank you for watching. I hope this video helped. And uh, yeah, now I think I'm gonna go play some Golden Axe now. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching and uh, here's some more crappy footage. And thank you very much for watching.